Authorities say the Walmart supervisor who allegedly shot and killed six of his co-workers at a store in Chesapeake, Virginia, left a message on his phone titled Death Note, in which he complained about his colleagues and referred to murder. Witnesses tell ABC News the gunman, Andre Bing, appeared to be targeting specific employees. He knew when we were in the break room. Starts 10 o'clock every night. The youngest victim, 16 year old Fernando Chavez Barron, his family holding a memorial in his honor. Fernando is my friend, best friend, everything. Like any other kid of a, uh, of a, in the community. On Monday, the entire Chesapeake community will hold a candlelight vigil to honor all the victims. Fernando, along with Lorenzo Gamble, Brian Pendleton, Kelly Pyle, Randall Blevins, and Tanika Johnson. There have been a series of recent deadly shootings across the country, including one at the University of Virginia and another inside a Colorado nightclub. On Thursday, President Biden reiterated his call for an assault weapons ban. The idea we still allow semi-automatic weapons to be purchased is sick. It's just sick. It has no, no social redeeming value. Zero. None. But investigators say the gunman in the Walmart shooting used a 9mm pistol he purchased legally just hours before the massacre. Police say they recovered the box and receipt for the weapon, along with ammunition from inside his home. Elizabeth Schulze, ABC News, Washington. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.